I would say 50% of the docks up there are holding redfish right now. It's always a great time of year to catch those big trout around the jetties, catching some nice ones and some nice reds mixed in with them. Starting to see better and better drum bites uh, down at the mouth of the river, uh, start breaking off of their schools, right on the on the cusp of that happening. It's, uh, you know, any kind of creek that's got a trough on it uh, is typically what I look for. I mean, just the traditional, you know, creek fishing for trout, uh, you know, they've, they've, been, they've been biting at it for sure. Today we caught fish on top order. So go ahead and mark that down. We're April the 1st and we're catching fish on top of it. Still reds to be caught everywhere, a little bit of black drum action, but uh, right now the pl most plentiful fishing is going to be great trout. Coming up between now and Mother's Day should have some schools of big black drum, uh, 50, 70, 80 pound fish moving. They'll be moving in big schools sometimes for two weeks at a time. Some good 30 to 32 inch stripers all up and down around New Bern. Those bigger style swim baits have definitely been producing the quality size fish on that. The fish are starting to move, the trout especially. We're starting to find some in some of the mouths of the creeks on the way out of the main river. To Saw some mullet around the inlet back down my way, around Oregon Inlet um, this weekend, which is anytime you get bait showing up, that's good. This is Gary with Fisherman's Post, and thank you so much for checking out the highlight reel from this week's Inshore Fishing Reports. If you enjoyed the highlight reel and want to check out the full hour's worth of content, you can do so here at fishermanspost.com slash members. You can sign up monthly or get a discount if you sign up for the entire year. And if you have any questions, we're happy to help.